Hey guys, what's going on? I want to shoot a video showcasing this tiny house on wheels. This is my cousin's that he built. He built 90% of it himself. I helped with some of the framing and some of the putting the metal on the outside. It's built on an old camper frame that he got for free. We cut the end of it off. It's an 8, I think an 8 by 16. It's kind of a shed style, so one side's bigger than the other, taller than the other. The metal uh, was upcycled, the windows, the roof metal, a lot of the plywood. The deck he paid for and built, the door was upcycled. I'll take you inside. As you can see, it's roughed in, or dried in rather. He's going to go back, put some sheetrock. Do some wiring. It's going to be off the grid, but he's going to go ahead and wire it anyways. That way, later on, if he wants to hook electricity up to it, or maybe some solar. I'm pretty sure the plan is back here, queen size bed. He talked maybe about bunk beds, but where that window's there, I'm not sure. He'll probably do like a small loft up top for storage, under the bed storage. Then over this way, pretty sure like a wood burning stove in the corner. Kitchenette this way and a way to sit down here. <coughs> Excuse me. He talked about going off the back of this and putting an outdoor shower. He's going to put water catchment in. Pan around, show it to you. I watch a lot of videos of people building tiny houses on wheels. They'll put in an 8x16 or an 8x20 tiny house on wheels, $30,000, $40,000. And it'll take them close to a year to build this. Uh, all in all, he probably has two weeks in this or last maybe a week building this and i think when he gets finished probably around two thousand dollars in the entire build i know a lot of the studs he already had he bought insulation bought that header built that header right there bought the advantech but other than that everything else is upcycled i'm going to try to uh Get some more video of this when he comes back down to to work on it maybe some time lapse if y'all want pretty sure he's going to do a composting toilet rainwater catchment with a pump and maybe some solar where he's at right here uh solar is not not the best because as you can see there's a lot of woods a lot of shade so stay tuned for more videos on this and as always thanks for watching 